Hey, how's it going everybody? Today we're going to take a quick look at another great open source project. So, it's called Kiwi X. And what it does is allow you to access information offline. Um, so you can store websites such as Wikipedia. Now this is very useful for, for places that have not reliable internet. So schools in rural areas and places like that. Maybe you've got a cabin in the woods and you'd like to access things like the Arch Wiki, um, this will allow you to do that. Um, it's even been used to smuggle um, websites into North Korea, so citizens of the DPRK can access websites such as Wikipedia, because you can install it on a Raspberry Pi or just put it on an SD card and stuff like that. It's been used in Cuba, um, one of the interesting things about Cuba is the citizens there have created their own intranet. Uh, they've even got World of Warcraft servers and they've got all sorts of um, servers that they've set up themselves. Um, there's all sorts of services, which is pretty cool. So these uh, each website stored in a ZIM file. Uh, one of the largest ones, of course, is Wikipedia. As you see, that's 93 gigs, but that's all of Wikipedia, including the images. Um, some of the smaller ones, such as ArchWiki, is only 44 megs. Here we've got a list of ZIM files you can download, all different languages. So we've got Ask Ubuntu and all sorts in here. But anyways, I'm running this on my file server. So you can also just store this on your laptop or desktop. For example, the ArchWiki might be useful if you're having issues with your network interface. But for example, we could click into Wikipedia and we can do a search for GNU. Um, oh, that's not the GNU I was thinking. So if I just search GNU again, get a list here. And that's the one I wanted. There we go. And then. Yeah, as you see, it even does all the pictures. Go back to the home. And go to Ask Ubuntu and search through Ask Ubuntu. And search through the Arch Linux wiki. Stack Exchange and yeah. So overall, I think this is a fantastic application which has um lots of uses um i got gigabit fiber so it's not really that useful to me but nonetheless i keep it on my server as a backup in case for some reason my internet stops working i still have access to some stack exchange uh resources and ask ubuntu and the arch wiki and um I guess Wikipedia could be useful, like if there's some sort of natural disaster or something and the infrastructure of everything goes down, but somehow I still have electricity. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I would be a hero. Anyways, that was KiwiX. I hope you all have a good day. See you later.